Hey man, it's the ISO God Sensei, the greatest on 2K in existence. And listen up, there is a huge shooting and finishing update. Game changing, game breaking. You're gonna wanna watch this full video. Man. There was a 10 hour Twitter space. Mike Wang was listening. He was messaging people. We gonna show you the messages. And he was listening to negative win percent, host scoring, sim nation, casual NPCs in the game. Things have been confirmed by 2K Live. We're gonna break it down, what it really means. We're gonna break down Mike Wang's statements, everything. The layups are broken. The real player percent, everything. That's your man, but before we get to all that, y'all make sure y'all subscribe. If y'all are new and you wanna stay up to date with 2K, we gonna put you on the all the sauce. Make sure you like the video if you agree with me. Now, firstly, what I want to show y'all, right? I wanna play a clip for y'all of this guy talking, okay? This is the number one ranked proven ground guy, and he's been in the 2K League hella years all that, okay? Listen to what he's saying. Okay, there's a lot of envious, negative win percent NPCs running their mouth, crying, trying to dictate the game for a game they're not even gonna play. Their post-scoring reality will never change, but li listen to this. Then we gonna, we gonna go into a 2K Lab chart. As you can see, this is how your green window move. We gonna break it down. Hold on. Saying that, I'm saying, again, mm. the whole, the, the purpose purpose of that was to make other gameplay styles yeah viable. i get it i get it we, I know, we know that twos are better than threes i mean excuse me threes are better than twos right mm -hmm. so people were making the same type of builds to get more three hunting to do different plays right mm -hmm. i'm not saying you're wrong again i just want to put that out oh, there yeah. i'm just saying does the changes that are made right now no promote other game styles and other gameplays and other games. <laughs> i just want to say one more thing before i yeah yeah, was, let me say one more thing, please. But imagine imagine in a different competitive space. Imagine you're playing Call of Duty. Uh -huh. And because you're getting too many kills, your gun is going to start to shoot different because you're just better than the people that you're playing against. <laughs> or any, That's or crazy. Anything, like, anything in life. Let me, let me please speak. Anything in life. No matter what, the best of the best players at anything, whether it's a video game. This is what's going on with 2K. Yeah, it's not no, oh, there's a all this other stuff. There are things put in place to bring up the bottom and bring down the top. It's not cool, okay? Y'all pay a hundred a bill for your builds, right? Come on. And it's things that they will never publicly admit. Oh, well, look at this. 2K Lab, we finna show you this test. They said everything is equal, wide open only. They wait for the stem, pump fake, then shoot. It's a script. They use an modded controller. And this is what is happening. Shot one. It's like this. Nothing's changed. Same stamina. Shot two, it moves. Shot three, it does this. Are, are y'all seeing this? Like, just, just just think about it. Just, just think about it, bro. Shot four, it moves. Okay. Now, your takeover should be building up, right? Like, the green meter, like, the green window should be getting somewhat bigger. I mean, I don't know if they just didn't test that or change it, but it's supposed to be like a build up, right? I want a hard shoot in 2K, but this is, look at this. Then when you, on your fifth shot, look, look, look what's happening, guys. Then your sixth shot. Look, look at this. Look, I already knew this was going on, bro. I've I've been talking about it. I've been trying to tell people. Now, another major issue with this is in a game with latency and lag, to have things like this, it's horrible. The servers are horrible. You guys aren't understanding. And then you're getting random dribble moves. Your moves are delayed. To have things like this, are, it's just fundamentally horrible. It's not a good gameplay experience for, for any. And also, I don't know if 2K knows this or if it's built into the game for some reason. You can get the same animation. Right? Say you're getting the same animation for catch and shoot or quick stop or whatever. It'll give you a different release, okay? And it's kind of like unpredictable sometimes. And it's been doing this since like 23. Like say you'll have a fade to the left, wide open. Sometimes it'll give you a slower one and the, or a faster one, right? And it's like, but you're, you're getting the same animation off it'll give you different catch and shoots different load ups and then sometimes you're getting a faster release or a slower release and then it's like and by the way i shot 75 percent last year bro the shooting is very easy the problem is it feels like mike wang's playing god and he's just punishing you for being good at the game bro it's it's very weird but yeah mike wang is saying we're gonna read his message soon he's saying that your Q lines up with the green one. I don't believe that, bro. I've been locking in since 23. Right when I get takeover, I might miss that up, right? And I'm staring so hard at my visual. Not using the muscle memory. I'm looking at my Q, dog. I'm in a lethal takeover. I'm looking at my Q. Miss that hole. 
everything built up. Come on, bro. And then th this is how you know it's cap. All the like super good players, from what I've seen, they're like saying the same thing. You don't think these players can not lock into their visual cue? There's something built in, okay? I'm telling you to nerf certain players, bro. Start getting this and that, certain type of ratings and stuff. Look, this is what he messaged Boomy. I don't know why uh he's the voice of the 2K community now. I don't I don't know what's going on, bro. But uh this is what this is what Mike Wang says. The visual cue doesn't move around in different spots in the animation. Ideal release point is always at the same point in the animation based on the cue you choose. Now listen to the cap he say, right? The problem with shooting is a lot of people are expecting to have the same success as they did in 2K24. Now this is a popular narrative among like horrible 2k players this just isn't it's not true bro people are reporting to you something that's happening. they're noticing it they're feeling whatever you're doing in the game is disrupting them bro you feel me it's it's like it's like for instance with 23 i could shoot on a build with silver badges and a way lower three point than a build that had a super high three and way more badges and hall of fame badges it was easier to shoot on the bigger build there's a reason for that they're catering to the people who choose those type of styles and builds over the ones that go for all this and that so it's like you're punished for picking certain type of ratings then he says but one of the main goals for 2K25 was to bring 3.0% down to earth, which is why green windows are much tighter by design. But listen, they're much tighter by design. Everyone would feel it, right? But it seems that people are getting tighter windows that are doing more extraordinary things, man. But look, then he says, the reason why we want 3.0% to be closer to NBA averages is because we believe it results in better basketball, okay? I, I actually, I want that to be a case. Then he says, it makes more builds viable and encourages more variety in scoring, etc. Three points start to hover around 60 through 70 on average. This never happened. When did this happen? When did this happen? He's cap. Who when was this the average? At a 75 iron. Ooh, this was not no average. I don't know what he's talking about. Then he says it makes no sense to ever attempt it to. Now, this is how you know he doesn't know his game. Okay. A lot of people they, they like to speak in theory and what like, but things have existed to prove what's going on, right? And what will ha would happen. 21 old gen is an example of a hard shooting 2k and what did that create it made people only make play shots because they were the only builds that could shoot so it made people play a play style you get what i'm saying because if you made a slash and playmaker or whatever build if you didn't have purple shooting you cannot shoot on that game consistent and that's just a fact so everyone's going to adjust and switch overall or they're not making no shots buddy now you've seen in other 2ks where the shooting's easier and people have hella bunch of builds i want the shooting to be hard way harder than everyone on the game most likely but that's not good for um versatile builds so in 24 you know he's trying to encourage more play styles i don't know how many bro there was hella play styles for 24 just like so many other games 19 there were so many play styles 17 there were so many play styles <laughs> that were viable uh 16 you could do everything in so many 2ks play styles were viable um so it's like it's like he don't understand the game you could do a scooper the layups you could uh do the five out running and dunking on everybody there are so many different styles, but I'm telling you what they really want is they want people to post score, bro. <laughs> And they're trying to find a way to destroy the game to make people want to post. I don't know like what's wrong with them, but that just ruins gameplay. Like, look, people at the stage right now are running with two centers. This, this is how you could tell how broken the game. People are running with two centers and having them stand in the paint while the person just chucks up shot. That's how like bad it's getting. That's crazy. Like two inside centers with like a 99 uh rebounding. Like, is that is that not crazy, bro? I always I I keep telling you the more you try to nerd movement or cheese or whatever you you trying to call it the speed the more people will cheese there that's what they're they're gonna go to the real cheese that people haven't used to get their buckets and that they could have been using in other stuff they're gonna find a way to get efficient right think about that guys two inside big centers running in and out the paint trying to get as many boards and kick it out to someone spamming rhythm shooting like think about that bro that's crazy bro in 24 people went for plenty of tools right for 24 uh, that 2k 
okay was horrible by the way um people go for twos every year i don't know what they're talking about bro i'm confused then he says so the animation fluctuation that labs posted today was put in place to combat zen obviously but we also thought it was justified because it increases the skill gap with shooting now, I, I think this is just a genjutsu right because if you make the shooting actually hard casuals they're not going to enjoy the game so what you have to be doing on the back end is making it easier for them to shoot in some way that they're not telling then he says a good user who's able to key a release off jumper visual cue blah 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 should be able to outperform a zen user now this would be a w if it was really implemented like this in some way but i don't i don't think it's like i think they're just trying to find a way to bring down the top justify it and make us just deal with that because bro if it's really just a visual cue you don't think like people would really like just lock in and just you know it's deeper than that bro. I'm, I'm telling you man now look look at this here here's another example of the nonsense guys like why is this implemented do they just not know or what like look look at this look power of real player percentage layups on 2k25 with real percentage on a 40 layup rating has a make rate of 47 and a half percent y'all see that you feel me like think think about that how does a 40 layup have a 47 percent chance to make it where you don't even have to time it versus 74 interior where someone's bigger than you think bro why think about that you feel me I'm, I'm i'm telling bro i'm trying to i'm trying to tell i'm telling y'all what they do it to y'all game you gotta fight back bro versus 74 interior defense and they give a he all in his face down 99 layup it will increase your mid rate to 74.5 look at this now 99 layup is 74 percent without timing it that's crazy and then guess what with a lot of the real player percent people hold it until your player gets out the way so it makes you more open right so like you you have even higher percents than these if you know how to actually slash correctly or acrobat because you'll be more open that's crazy bro that's crazy to me you know i've been, been hearing from a lot of people that the paint d is pretty bad i don't know man <laughs> i don't know bro like i don't think real player percent should be a uh be able to be used online bro especially at these percents that's crazy think about it what's the point of timing it that, that's why i told all y'all people are smoking open layups and everything i told y'all just put on real player percent or put on uh the low risk one. and uh, everyone i told they'd be like you're a lifesaver you change it changed my life i've been told y'all in my sentence video you feel me but i don't know though look so this guy tagged a dev about this clip where buddy teleported he speed boosted and the dev said it's a bug right so this could be this is definitely if he's saying it's a bug that means it's definitely getting patched so maybe Deion sanders steals are getting patched hold on let me show y'all crazy one. let me know if y'all want them patched yeah, this, I, I was talking about this in the space when this happened please look at that bro this is exactly what happened watch watch come on look at this are we look at this look at this look at this so look he not even looking at this dude right I don't know if he gonna break this down. He not even looking at this dude. And look, look what he does. Look, he's throwing it to him. Look at this. And he's gonna, he's teleporting. Like he pressed square because he thinks it's going to him, right? So it's automatically already teleporting. Oh, look, at this. look at that. Are you serious? That's that's Deion Sanders in his prime, bro. Direction. Look at this. He's changing direction. Oh. Watch. I'm about to slow it down for you. Yo. I'm about to slow it down. This Yo. has to get out the game. What I just got was a good thing. Look. This turns. is crazy. He turns. He's turning left. He's turning left. Look at him. <laughs> That's got to go. That's got to go. Oh, God. That's crazy. I do want lanes to be like nice and real good but that that's od but but 2k bro i don't know deep bro i be hearing that they be taking like three years to create these games so it's not really like a one year cycle somewhat turnaround like they be doing things like building them i don't know bro but this is crazy i don't know and this is just to shut down everything for y'all that saying people are crying and all this and that listen to what he's saying very closely okay okay
Now, people keep asking if there's a pure green window and he's not answering, right? But anywho, and they're, they're never going to tell you everything, guys, because they will be scrutinized. They, you know, you guys have to think beyond the box, okay? He says, this is what it all boils down to. If anyone has ideas for a better option than these two, I'd love to hear them. Keep pure green windows. By the way, there was never pure, no pure window. It was just a bigger pure green window. And he says, no RNG. There's never been a pure green window in my eyes. There's always been some sort of RNG. Right. Greener miss is just a visual thing. If you guys don't know, 2K Labs even confirmed, bro. Like, all they did was make most of your whites that you would hit in old 2Ks that would go in, they just made those turn green. That's all greener miss is, bro. It's a visual. Then he says, which means for the sake of balance, the windows need to be pretty small like they are now so that good players don't shoot 80 through 93.0%. This makes shooting very difficult for casual players and what we're dealing with now. Do y'all think, think, right? You see? So how can they think that this is their epidemic? How can they make the top percent not be able to shoot too good, but at the same time, make the bottom, which is the majority, be able to shoot good by having things set in place to limit skilled players? but then making it easier for the bottom in some way. And it's not just with those timings. Low key, those timings really prove what we've been talking about. They made that public. Hold on. Y'all not, y'all, y'all not even, y'all don't even get it, bro. Those things like, who knows if this is true or not, but it makes sense, bro. Because I always told you they're all to bring down the top while bringing up the bottom, how can they actually do that? People are playing, he's saying people playing on different settings. They automatically assign these type of settings based on the stats overall panel color. I'm gonna tell you, just just read it, bro. Read what he's saying, bro. Now then look at this, look, look at the second option. Go back to bigger green windows that are easier for most people to hit, but cap the excellent timing boost. Reintroduce RNG to keep the game balanced. This is how 2K, shooting has been basically for the past 20 years so as you can see whites are back so what, what do y'all think is going on what do y'all think is going on now i've played those older 2ks bro and they were harder to shoot compared to the newer 2k for sure 18 after besides 21 old gen those 2ks are way e easier to shoot on even though they say like the pure green window and all that but they were easier to shoot on but i think rng is in every 2k bro like you time it right they make you miss that hole that's what full whites are that's what a full bar is if you guys didn't know you just couldn't see you missing the green but um i just feel like you gotta get better at the game dog like i, I shouldn't be penalized for uh timing a shot correctly like make them suffer i mean people got to learn to play defense also bro if you can't guard someone and they're getting an open shot that's on you play d feel me i'm not talking about making it over people if i'm wide open i time it right it should go in bro oh I, I don't know bro that this 2k like everything has like gotten worse like the defensive movement is trash it's just offense is so good. Dribbling trash, the slashing trash, like you have no control over your mod player. It's like everything just digressed. It did, I don't I don't know, bro. I don't know if I'm crazy or what, bro, but I think y'all should have just supported NBA Live, bro, because this is not 2K, and the gameplay changes every year. Anyone that knows that, you know, you still have the same overall issues like Paint D's trash, but the gameplay changes every year. The dribbling changes, the shooting changes every single year, so no one's saying they want the same game. We're saying you could be inspired by, you know, your great games, but no one's saying just keep giving us the same game, but... I don't like, I don't know, man. We spending money on this game, dog. You gotta make it fun, bro. Y'all, the, the, the player hating? I don't know, man. It's, it's, <laughs> it's getting sad, bro. Like, bro, it's a video game, man. We trying to have fun on this whole, like, to keep trying to nerf the five to 10% of players. And by the way, 99.9999% of players did never played versus in. I don't know, bro. This was crazy. Hey, if y'all want the best jump shots in NBA 2K25 and all the greatest tips, click on the video on the screen. But hey, hey, here we go again. Yeah. Here we go again. People talking this, but when this hit the fan, everything I'm that made me. Now break it down. Yo, off the top of the dome, dome.